what Daily Proven Exotics was founded on. Started with a Gallardo, eventually moved to the Huracan. We've got the Squadra Corsa, and we've thought about getting an Aventador. It's really been the bread and butter of this brand. Now, this car has seen a few miles. I heard Lamborghini has some new jam in the garage. I think it's time we go and check out what that is. You guys, this is what dreams are made out of. They have row upon row of exotic cars. Lamborghini Newport Beach. Wow, look at this purple Huracan Evo Spider. Pretty sick. So sick. This is the new car that Lamborghini has introduced. The Huracan Evo. This is the updated, latest, greatest from Lamborghini. And this has a whole bunch of amazing things like all wheel steering, Dave. It's pretty it's good. It's got torque vectoring. Do big that words is? for Damon. What's that? It's like a stability control where it puts more power to the left or the right side to control you in a corner if you're losing control. Kind of like brake steer? Oh no. The McLaren 2012 did that. Torque vectoring. You know what? These guys are all really busy. I don't really want to start bothering people. So I saw a key over here. Anybody looking? Look around. Keep an eye out. Keep an eye out. Anyone looking? You take it. Sneak it. Sneak it. Sneak it. What car is it? Oh. Oh. All right. I think we could steal this thing without anybody even notice. So, 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 so. Hold on. Just casually get in it. Thank you. Oh, look at this spec. Funny. They even left the door open. Let's get out of here. this thing Shh. walking over here kind of wondering what's going on all right let's uh subtly sneak out of the parking lot it's all good i know the owner oh, of lamborghini, lamborghini. <laughs> well you guys we've done it i finally got my hands on the brand new huracan evo being a lamborghini huracan owner i'm really excited to see what the updates have actually done in terms of driving the car now one of the fun features of this new model is right here in the center of the console it is this infotainment system and they have an option under vehicle where if you go to LDVI it's actually going to show you all of the things that are going on with the power in the car and the distribution of it well it's no slouch I'll tell you that the, the power senior. department the cool thing is is this has the exact same engine as what is in the Performante and exhaust system did you know that no so check this out if we go down to sport and then go down to Corsa, look. Oh yeah, Performante. Performante Dash, which is what everybody wants, including me, so I'd have to buy a new car to get it. Full sand? Yes, 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 yes. They do make an amazing car. Right out the box, this thing is not slow. Even for a guy who drives a twin turbo version. You want some? things are the new all-wheel steering and that torque vectoring. Of course, it's going to be the most efficient version of this car. So it's really going to be the mode that you want to go to the track in and try to put down fast lap times. If you want to play with this car, I was told the mode to be in is actually sport. And what sport is designed to do right from the factory for the very first time is to allow you to play and slide that car around, which is what we like to do here at Daily Driven Exotics. <laughs> behind these walls. Welcome to Vorsteiner. For the audience that's been DD fam for a long time, as you guys know, Vorsteiner was my partner, my sponsor for building the Huracan in its first original format. 
I got my new Huracan. I was looking for an Aero. I was looking for a killer body kit for that car. And Vorsteiner came through. To this day, the best looking, in my opinion, body kit for the first gen Huracan. Now that the Evo is out, they are revealing a brand new Aero kit for this car. And they've asked us to come and be the ambassadors to Vorsteiner. Very excited. I haven't even seen this kit. They want to reveal it to you and to me at the exact same time. So I feel super honored. Secret alley of Vorsteiner. Out of. <laughs> I'm reading you for a beach. I stole it. Let's yeah. cut it up. Let's go. <laughs> Guys, Nick from Vorstein. How you doing? Good guys, how are you guys? Amazing. So you've got some carbon stuff that you've now got developed for this. We do. So we are excited to release our new Huracan Evo kit. You guys wanna come take a look? Absolutely. So the new 2020 Evo Aero kit. Come take a look at this beauty. Yes. Wow. So these are the renderings for our brand new Huracan Evo kit. That is insane. It is, isn't it? So we got a couple different components. It's gonna be a front spoiler, side skirt, rear diffuser, and full wing replacement. This whole deck is gonna get replaced. Our uprights come up. We're gonna have that center upright, similar to the SVJ. A lot of our design elements come from other uh, design elements that other Lamborghini and Porsche and other OE manufacturers have used over the years. So. Yeah. Yeah, you're gonna see a lot of little SVJ uh, tie-ins on the Evo, but still our own flavors to of them. Of course. And the whole wing's gonna come down, essentially over the whole rear of the vehicle. Lower diffuser. On the Evo, you can actually replace the whole diffuser. Compared to the Huracan and previous generations, you couldn't actually replace the diffuser. It was all one piece. That's right, it was the, the whole bumper. bumper. It's the whole bumper. It's a direct bolt-on, bolt-off when we do the development on our full diffuser. That is so cool. I like how you guys have this like really like accenting and accentuated where it's coming out more. Now, your forged carbon, which is the name that Lamborghini, or I think that's just the industry standard forged so, carbon? Correct, yeah, so Lamborghini uses forged carbon. Matrix is our name for our forged carbon. Yeah. Essentially, ours is a little bit different. Take uh, standard two by two pre prayed carbon weaved already and actually cut that weave up and hand lay it into the mold all mixed up. So it's still using a stronger two by two weave pre prayed weaved uh, carbon already compared to the industry, which the, the forged carbon essentially is a wax. So uh, our matrix carbon is actually stronger than the factory forged carbon. Crazy. Dave, you impressed? Not that impressive. And then side skirts. <laughs> yeah. Right now, it's going to be a full side skirt that's going to essentially um, bolt on to the actual factory piece. Uh, it'll have a, essentially a winglet here that'll go the whole length of the side skirt. Now, are you going to keep the same louvered fender? Someone could get a louvered fender from the Novara current kit. Exactly. And it's going to flow with this. Why design another fender? Exactly. Big thing with all of our kits is the direct bolt on. So mm, exactly. you're not cutting or splicing into the car. It's something that you can bolt onto the car. If you decide to sell or trade the vehicle back in, you can take it off and it's back to stock. Last but not least, the front end of this beauty. One of our big things is everybody loves their front spoiler. Yes. So, the front spoiler that we've designed is essentially gonna wrap all the way around the lower section of the front bumper. It's gonna have a two piece where it's gonna come up and also below as well. I think you guys really nailed it from this render because this is a cool bumper, but it isn't as aggressive as I was expecting of a change. Lamborghini, they went a little soft I feel like on this and you guys are really bringing it home to where like I wanted that SVJ kind of like in your face look. That's always been our thing. You look back at the Verona, the Navarra kit that we've done for the first generation of the Huracan, the Senza kit for the Preformante, we really take it to the next level and this Evo kit's really gonna be the ultimate of the Evo era. Now you guys have a crazy hood too. We do, we do. So and we, the hood has like kind of the two dimples. It does, it does. So we do a uh, exposed carbon hood, also matrix carbon hood, definition of the air intakes on the hood yeah. uh, that add that design element that a lot of guys like to see on their hood. Design elements from like, again, the racing team. Yeah, uh, motorsport. Lamborghini. Correct. Yeah. Everybody wants to watch their dream car on TV. This racing car be a reality in their garage. And this is what you got when you come to Vorsteiner. You get the louvered fenders. You get the crazier diffuser. So am, I, am I getting the first one or what are we, what are we doing here? What's yeah, up? we need one? to get it. Do we need we'll an Evo? I, I think need you need one. Evo. I mean, we got the, the Evo here now. We right. might as well just start cutting yeah, it up right now. Back eventually. We would have to take it back. Uh, we need one very big flaw mistake in stealing a car. 
We left two Lamborghinis in replace of this one. We also, at the put, we also put on the internet. <laughs> I mean, I have to admit, take two Lamborghinis for a Vorsteiner equipped Evo, I think I might take the Evo. It's true. I, I know for a fact that it would probably give me less headache. I might be the problem there, so you know, I could probably destroy this car as well. I can't wait to see one actually on the roads driving around. Nick, thanks again Always. for everything you guys have done for supporting us over the years. Yes. I'm excited for this and it is time for us to go to the next level with Lamborghini. It's been a brand that supported us from day one. So keep your guys' eyes out. Back into the sunshine we go. Let's take this beautiful beast back to the dealership. They want it back? Yeah, I think the, the low jack or whatever they have on these yeah, things. The low jack's starting to go It's off. beeping or I hear something going on. All right, we got a driver change here. Dave, I only think it's fair because in most of these videos, you kind of get a little ripped off. Why? I mainly drive the car. <clears throat> Why is that? Uh, I just, I don't know. The drivers always hand me the keys. I don't know what that means, guys. But this time, Lamborghini Newport Beach. I requested they take Dave's license and let Dave drive. You are a modern day hero. Not all heroes wear capes, Dave. I was calling in a favor just for you. Enjoy it. This could be the upgrade from the Squad Corsa one day, 10 years from now. Okay, let's go. Oh, it's so fast! <laughs> oh my god! Oh! Don't go oh, no, 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 don't touch it! It's too fast! <laughs> What did you think of your first experience in the Evo? Here's what I'm thinking, you guys. First sale, 2014 Lamborghini Squadra Corsa. You gonna sell it? <laughs> I want one of these. They're... I love the Squadra, but this is such a nice car. And one thing about Lamborghini, nothing feels the same steering wheel feel as a Lamborghini. Ferrari, McLaren, not even close. It's so tight. Sorry, I swore. I'm excited. <laughs> well, for now, we gotta go give the keys back. Do we? Unless you want to drop some coin. Trade in? I feel like the Squadra with all the DDE appeal from Dave driving it makes it worth more. Oh makes god. it worth more. Oh my god. Go straight across you guys, we gotta get out of here before his ego won't let him get out of the car. What a beautiful car. Okay. Tell you what, you get this. All right, here's what we're gonna do. You get the Evo. Okay. And Damon gets an SVJ. Big boys toys right here. Well, I can make my Evo look like the SVJ with Fortuner's new kit. That's true. This is a lot like the kit we just looked at. Oh. Dave, can I buy this? Can you call, can you call the accountant and say, hey, Damon's got some new toys he wants Actually, to buy. Can you please give him permission to buy an SVJ? Why again do I have a stupid accent? All right, Dave, I've changed my mind yet again. Oh, Found Damon's. out what I want. I want this. I want this. I want, I want the Senna GTR. Look at all the stuff that's going on in this car and the wing. You thought the Senna wing was big? Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you the Senna GTR wing. And the diffuser, holy. Thank you guys, thank you guys. You can have your car back. Thank, thank you, you yeah. so much. So we took the car. <laughs> Even though you didn't do anything. <laughs> thank you, Nick Jones. Wow. Thank you for what? Thank you thank for, you for uh, giving us the Huracan Evo. Oh wait, I didn't know you took it. Uh, I have the, I just had the paperwork sitting here. Uh, the, yeah, the, yeah. And all jokes aside, we love Jeremy. Even though he didn't do anything this trip. <laughs> Are we buying a car or what? He wants to get the Evo, and I'm gonna get an SVJ. All right, so what's the problem? We have two trade-ins right over there. They're DD cars, so they're worth more. Straight yeah. across. Straight across. Garage cab. Straight across. Garage, Garage cab. cab. Never been driven Straight hard. across. Always, yeah, yeah baby. Okay, we're out of here. and like the F12, you could buy this car. I'm not selling those two cars for this car. Why? I like this car, but I love the Mercy and the F12. This car is way better to drive Shut than your the mouth when I'm talking Lago, to you. Old analog piece of shit. This is modern. <laughs> this, is like driving a, this is like driving a Mac. Whoa. 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 There's a reason why manuals Stop. are dead because they're incompetent compared to the dual clutch in these cars. Well, that's single clutch, so I lost my point on that one. They have incontinence? 